This is a piston guide oil seal replacement video for the General Pump Model HTS-2215S. The tools and supplies needed for this repair are a ratchet, a 13mm socket, a 17mm socket, two support pins, an adjustable wrench, packing lubricant, two flathead screwdrivers, a soft rubber mallet, a piston guide oil seal removal tool, a pick, thread lubricant and sealant, and a torque wrench. Use a ratchet with a 13 millimeter socket attached to remove the eight manifold retaining bolts. Insert two positioning pins into the upper outermost holes. Use an adjustable wrench to rotate the crankshaft. This will separate the manifold from the crankcase. Insert two flathead screwdrivers between the manifold and the crankcase and pry the manifold from the crankcase. Remove the manifold. Remove the two support pins. Use a ratchet with a 17 millimeter socket to loosen and remove the plunger bolt and the plunger. Use a needle nose pliers to remove the flinger washer. Insert the piston guide oil seal removal tool into the cylinder and hammer into place. Firmly pull the tool and the old piston guide oil seal out of the cylinder. Apply a new piston guide oil seal onto the insertion tool. Insert the tool and the new seal into the crankcase. Hammer the insertion tool until the new seal is securely in place. Install a copper washer an O-ring and a backup ring onto the plunger bolt. Apply a small amount of Loctite onto the thread of the plunger bolt. Install the assembled bolt into the plunger. Install the flinger washer over the piston guide. Thread the plunger bolt onto the piston guide. Use a torque wrench with a 17 mm socket and tighten the plunger bolt to the proper specs. Use an adjustable wrench to rotate the crankshaft until the center plunger is at its outermost position while the other two plungers are staggered. Insert the support pins into the two upper holes of the crankcase. Apply packing lubricant to each of the plungers. Slide the manifold onto the crankcase. Apply thread lubricant onto each of the manifold bolts. Thread six of the manifold bolts into the crankcase. Use a ratchet with a 13 mm socket to tighten each of the bolts. Be sure to tighten the bolts in the proper order as shown in the diagram. Remove the two support pins. Thread the remaining two bolts and use a ratchet with a 13 mm socket to tighten the remaining two bolts. Use a torque wrench with a 13 mm socket to tighten to the proper specs.